hope you find the surroundings to your liking. It's a new twist. To sit down. Comfort, privacy, complete security. What more could you ask for? The answer to a couple of questions. Try me. Where's the cine film from the XV-104? As I was about to say, fortunately, the camera in question wasn't damaged. Then did I or didn't I see an unidentified flying object? <laughs> You're not sure. Don't play games. You know, I believe you saw something. Well, at least that's a start. Ah, coffee. Jackson. Let's stop fencing around. Now, that film shows close-ups of an object, right? Now, I'm an experienced test pilot. That thing was extraterrestrial, I'm telling you. Around the film, Si. the other aircraft. What have you done? <laughs> what have you done? Erased it, fixed it. Why? Why should I do that? <laughs> I ought to knock that smile right back down. <laughs> yes, things are not always what they seem to be, Mr. Foster. <laughs> You saw that. More games. Did you see it stop? Stop? Look, I throw it up, and it falls back into my hand. But for a split second, just at the top of the trajectory, it stops. Did you see it? But it did stop. If you say so. No, Foster, it didn't. It's moving forward at 500 knots, like everything else in this plane. And yet again, this whole aircraft is moving with the rotation of the Earth. Confusing, but fact. Apparent facts can be confusing in an aircraft at night at 250,000 feet. Now, tell me all about it. What did you see from that cockpit? An extraterrestrial spacecraft. A light source? Yes. A trick of light? No. A reflection from the instrument panel? No. Refracted from the glass of your visor and the windscreen? No! There are a hundred other explanations. Only one, and you know it. Well, I have a report to write. Um, if you... If you could give me a few facts. Uh, your name, Paul Foster, address, I have it. Uh, you've been a pilot for? Eight years. Eight years. And a test pilot for two. Right. Mm. Now, I can see here you reported a sighting three years ago. Yes. And another two and a half years before that. That's right. Then we shouldn't be meeting again for another couple of years. <laughs> <laughs> 